Hello, I am Test Drive, and welcome to episode 15 of Ford Racing 3. In this episode, since we finished off the Ford competition, we are going to be working on the Ford Challenge for the next Ford Challenge allows you to collect various vehicles, episodes. tracks, and race types for your Ford collection. Win a vehicle's challenge to collect that vehicle, that track, and that race type. Okay. Yeah, pretty much that. So it's basically the way that Ford Racing 2 worked, but it's only a part of this game instead of being the entire game. And uh, I've decided that I will be doing four of these per episode. And uh, I guess we'll start off with uh, with some Thunderbirds. Why not? Start off with the 55 Thunderbird. I don't really feel like doing it on hard. We're going to do shit on medium. Let's race. I know I can win on hard, but... I Stay don't feel like, to earn boost. you know, don't feel like Three, actually doing hard. Two, one, go. So, we're going to do this. Oh, excuse me, coming through. Give me boost. Let's see, remember, see, uh, let's see if I hit remember how to play this game, because, like, I have been recording on a different Let's Play that is not car-related recently, so... I have to get my mind back into the land of car instead of bang pow. Oh god. Go. Go Thunder Thunderbird. Go. Excuse me, coming through. Oh god. We're good. Hey, there's a ranchero in first. I think I, to, I, think I get to drive the ranchero now, actually. Come here, ranchero. Bye, Rancho. You do. Oh, okay, yeah. I'm pretty sure the Rancho is unlocked in this mode. I'm like 80% sure. That's alright by me. Of course, I'm mostly excited to drive the new and wacky stuff that was in this game, but not in Ford Racing 2. Which, the 55 Thunderbird was definitely in Ford Racing 2, so... Yeah. As was the 03 Thunderbird. Which we will probably drive this episode. Probably, maybe? I don't know. Oh, God. This thing still handles like crap, even with the boost. It does not handle good. So yeah, to, uh, to talk about the difficulties, basically on easy, you just complete it and you unlock the car and the track and the whatever. On medium, you unlock the car plus the livery packs, which are pretty much just paint colors. And on hard, you unlock a, a metal as, yeah, along with the uh, other shit that I just mentioned. And I really don't care about a metal, so... Hence why I am going to be doing this on not on hard. My brain's going kind of slow at the moment. Uh oh. That almost worked. Oh, make the turn. Go, Thunderbird. That was hmm, not great. Brains do be like that. My brain's like that a lot. My brain might need help. But help, it's not going to get. We're just sending it at this point. I was for two gamers. I'm not a true gamer then, yes. I'm not a true gaming enthusiast. If I don't play on hard, smile. Not a true car enthusiast. <laughs> oh, so I'm gonna try and keep talking about what what happened uh, to a minimum during this, since we've already went over everything. That is all in the past, and also on Twitter on October 18th, 2020. If anybody's curious. Yeah, you gotta pay. <laughs> Obviously. Yeah. Mm 
Oh god, please, please, please. This car really sucks, by the way. Shit is whack. That's basically the gist of what happened. Finish. People can be kind of silly here and there, you know? You win. But there we go, there's our first race done. Also, we get uh, driver rating for getting medium, hard, or easy, whatever. Oh, I don't really care about that still, so... We've unlocked. Yeah, I think so, Reaper. Livery pack collected. It lasted as long as it needed to. Challenge unlocked. Ooh, 73 Mach 1. Alright. Cool. Alright, so... Uh, I'm not going to get a thumbnail out of that car. So we'll exit back to here. I kind of want to do the Mustang, actually. Mustangs. I'm going to do Challenge the Mustang. Selected. Let's race. There was a lot. There, there was a lot going on yesterday. Three, two, That's one, basically what what happened. Oh. What is this car's engine note? Like when you get higher, it goes. Duh, 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 duh. It sounds like it's had a, just a bad misfire and no exhaust. I know because my Ranger kind of sounded like that. That had a bad misfire and a huge exhaust leak before the muffler. Yeah, yeah, you can only have this car in yellow because, you know, it's Eleanor, obviously, smile. Uh-oh. Also, we're doing a duel, which is fun. Haha. -ha. Galaxy. I think it's a galaxy, at least. Airline? I don't know. It's not the 63 Galaxy, obviously. Or 64. I don't know. I don't remember every car from this game. Oh god. <laughs> Shut the hell up, Reaper. That's how you get... Well, I mean, to be fair, I do like the 2000 Gone in 60 Seconds more than the original one. I know that may be heresy to some people, but... The old one's just... It's so cheesy. It has so much cheese. Also, I appreciate that it still says 60 as the license plate. Yeah, I guess if you're into that, then it's the appeal. Like I said, I am... I'm not into, like, super cheesy movies, so... I am, uh... I am a movie elitist, by the way. Smile. No, I'm not that. Maybe. Mustang? I saw a Mustang. Also, I don't know if I actually showed these off in any way during the career. I don't know if... Did we have any of these? Basically, you, you pass more cars uh, as the lap goes on. You go from passing one car in the first lap to three cars in this lap to, like, five. Or, not three, but two to four. The next next uh, next lap. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, you could say that. Oh, yeah, that was a Mustang, by the way. Yeah, I think it is. Because I don't remember doing this before. I think I did these on Ford Racing 2, but not in this game. There's going to be a couple of different types of events that I haven't been on yet. One is seconds out, returning from Ford Racing 2. But it's slightly changed. Which we'll see whenever we get there. I love not having headlights at work, by the way. Hmm. What could be the reference there? Says a person who owns a 2000 Bullet Mustang or 2006 Bullet Mustang that doesn't know about the movie Bullet. I can imagine that some some of those cars probably have uh, people that have owned them that have not seen you know the movie and don't know anything about the movie. I really feel like they do. Hell yeah. And I just think that's funny. To be honest. You're like, bullet? What's that? And then never look it up. And never, never try to learn what it is. It's great! 
They probably just sell, found one for cheap and like, ooh, a fancy Mustang. I love Mustangs. Smile. Hey, Grand Trino. Goodbye, Grand Trino. Goodbye, Starsky and or Hutch. I'm gonna keep taking this shortcut until I die. Cause I like taking that shortcut. Ow. I still don't like the way this car sounds, by the way. Oh shit. I'm not paying attention. Aha, later nerds. I'm winning this race. It do. It really do. Alrighty. Is that done? Eliminated. Opponents eliminated. You win. <sighs> also, there's only three opponents, by the way. Alright. Cool. So there's that. We'll get our rating points. Car collected. I don't know, can't relate. I don't play Gran Turismo Sport. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. collected duel, by the way. Ooh, I get to pick. Well, you know what I'm gonna pick? The one with the new car. I like the sport track, but I'm gonna pick the one with the new car. AKA the XB Falcon, which is down here somewhere. There it is. Ooh, we actually have the Fairland lock too. I'm gonna do... Oh, there's a relay too. I forgot about the relay. The relay is super weird. Challenge we'll do the relay. Let's race. Shift 2. Bro, I haven't played Shift 2 in years. You can't Three, expect me to know things about it. One, go. Relay races are wacky. Oh god. Now, also, I'm pretty sure that there's overtake races, like PGR2 kind of style overtake races in this game as well. I do give them credit. They did try to just definitely up the content in this game. Yeah, there's overtake races. I specifically remember uploading a video years ago of just getting absolutely demolished in one of those. Oh god. I think I remember how this works. I think I have to draft somebody. Because there's no more drafting events, I'm pretty sure. Or is there? I don't know. But I'm pretty sure I have to draft a car after I get past the, the, the lap marker and then switch to that car, basically. I think. I don't know. That sounds vaguely correct. Yep. Hello, Galaxy. Let's go. Oh, God, I was in first gear. Why was I in first gear? About to fuck around and find out. And I definitely found out. I appreciate that the driver doesn't move their arms at all while steering. At least not that I can tell. I don't think the steering wheel moves at all. I do appreciate the fact that your helmet is the same color as the car. I do like that. That's a nice little detail. Yep, hell yeah, color coordination. Gotta love it. 
I too love to wear yellow clothes whenever I drive my Chrysler TC by Maserati. Smile. I actually don't even think I own anything that's actually yellow. Any kind of clothing item. I think the closest is tan. It really be like that. Draft your partner to change the baton. Oh god. Hello there, 46 Ford. Baton change success. I have no clue what you just said. I don't know if I want to know. Oh god. Oh god, this car is so much understeer. Why? She gets wacky. Ah, these only have four gears because in real life they only have three gears. It's like everything has one gear more than what it should have in this game, except for like the Ford Focus SVT, which has one gear less in this game than what it has in real life. At least it's in Ford Racing 2. I haven't actually driven in this game in a long time, so I don't know. I can't imagine it would have changed though. year for GT. I don't think so. I don't think that's how that works, sadly. It'd be cool if there was a 7 year 4 GT, but I I don't think they did that. I mean, <laughs> you win. Oh, God. <laughs> Car collected. It works. I got the Falcon. Pack collected. I got a livery pack for the Falcon. Race type collected. <laughs> I get what is. We also unlocked the relay. Hey, we unlocked the uh, 68 Mustang. Cool. Alright. Fuck. I was supposed to watch GT. replay there. I guess we're doing the, the Falcon. Fairlane, whatever it is. Let's race. <laughs> Collect the required number of bonus. Alright. Oh, it's a uh, second out. Let's go. But yeah, you have to hit the green ones, but not the red ones, basically. If you hit the red ones, you will lose your money and lose your mind. I need to remember to uh, watch a replay for this as well. Target avoidance, hell yeah! That's my favorite thing. I love avoiding the objective. Oh god. This is kind of weird, but it's definitely more interesting than the old seconds out, for sure. Oh god. If. Well, I mean, I guess I only have one lap on this, probably. Or no. Shit. I have to hit a certain amount of the green ones without hitting the red ones. Okay. That makes sense. And a win. Maybe. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, fuck you! These are kind of weird, I'm not gonna lie. Because, like, it doesn't go under zero. But you have to complete a lap? Finish. I don't know, it's kind of weird. Anyways, I won. You win! Kind of a strange way to do it, but it's all right. And I will watch the replay this time. We collected the fair lane. Livery pack collected. Livery pack for the fair lane. Race type collected. Seconds out. And I want new stuff. Give me focus. All right, replay. I got a YouTube notification.
Oh. I literally watched the Project Melody video, then started streaming, and this this song in the stream, YouTube's like, oh, by the way, there's a new Project Melody video. Okay. <laughs> what is going on? Alright, so now that should work. It'll be good enough. But, there we go. That will conclude this episode of Ford Racing 3. Next one, we will uh, we'll do some more stuff. Ooh. Stay tuned for that, and I shall see you then.